Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then um, hi, nice to meet you. My name's Imani, and today we are filming a haul. A haul I wasted so much fucking money on, but I'm gonna leave that up to you guys. I'm gonna, you know, let you have your own opinions. I'm sure you're gonna agree with me. It was a waste of money. So, honestly, like, I don't know, like, stand, subscribe, maybe. Some of y'all's favorite, like, story time, um, story time, Hall Girl got canceled recently, um, so I mean, make some room for me, I guess, I don't know. We're just gonna get right into it. First of all, I ordered from Sheen. Sheen is a company I've heard a lot about. All my friends, like, talk about Sheen and how, like, good their shit is, and I'm not, like, knocking them because, um, I do get some nice stuff that I like from there, but at the same time, half the shit is not true to size that makes me sad because i am like a you know thicker girl and the fact that i just can't find shit true to size is just it breaks my heart it breaks my fat ass heart in the keep the pile what the fuck in the keep pile we have this lovely yellow like moment i if this fit, I would love it. This is supposed to be like cropped. I can't try it on obviously because like my tits will fall out, but you know. <laughs> you know, um, it's supposed to be cut like this and then you pull this to give you more like of a push up factor. But um, I just have hella under boob in this. Also, it has these horrid ass like pads in them. Please. I think they like it better if like they didn't have that. Like not to like sound like a whore, but you know, who doesn't love a good tip moment, I guess. So yeah, the quality is, I mean, could have been better. I can tell it's a swimsuit. I can tell you have to like go swimming in it, but it was a set. So it also came with these bottoms that barely fucking match. And um, they're supposed to give you this tie dye effect and it doesn't online look so much different. And I mean, they fit really good. They gave me some like ass, I mean, but. Next up, we have these shorts. They are a little wide. I'm not this wide. I'm not this wide. <laughs> and they kind of like slip off me and when they Oh, I can't really explain how I feel about these because I can definitely wear them, pull them up, and they give me like a mom jean effect, which I don't like totally hate. Like I can wear them with a big t-shirt, I guess. And um Hopefully I can have them tailored because I actually do really like these shorts. They just are like hanging the fuck off me. Like I'm like skinny maybe, I don't know. Cause these are a three X. Three X means like an 18. My fat ass worked it toward. I know like the plus sizing, how that goes. So yeah, definitely, you know, keep maybe. Doesn't really give me an ass moment, but I mean, I guess I can live with it. I don't know. <laughs> Next, we have more shorts. I don't like these, but I couldn't return them because my dumbass threw away the, um, what's it called? The packaging, the receipt, whatever. And they, I don't know, I'm not really feeling them like that. The model was um, not as thick as me, I could tell. And they really spread out on her. So I thought maybe my thighs would spread and I could pull these out, but I was wrong because <laughs> 3x is just too big for me I guess all of a sudden I do wear like 16 18 but I got an 18 to be on the safe side better safe than sorry but now I just feel sorry so yeah I didn't even show you what this red ribbon set it's like corny it says like fashion this is your best choice this is your best choice oh wait I didn't Choice is spelled wrong. You would think I typed this shit. Yeah, um, there's misspelling. Choice is spelled. <laughs> Choice is spelled C H U I C E. This is your best choose. I have a headache. I'm so sorry. This, like, give me a headache. 
my god okay yeah big too big misspelled tag and i mean i have to keep them now so next up we have these shorts they're covered in like cute little fun strawberries i'm pretty sure these are a two eggs yeah they're not like dick appointment material i will give them like that they're more like wear around the house-esque you know what i mean so they also came with a little top with like um i can't think i'm so sorry with straps that like tie over so you can adjust like you know your length i guess whatever or the tightness on your shoulder cute can't show you it on because it like shows my whole entire tit so yeah next up is this shirt um i actually kind of like it i don't know like it's just you know kind of cute i like shirts that are like different colors on the um neck i think they're called like ringer shirts i think that's what x21 calls them i'm not sure the quality is also really good to be like a seven dollar shirt i was not expecting the quality to be this like soft and nice and i don't know i just really stand this shirt even though i don't have anything to wear with it i got this in a zero xl now I'm surprised it fit because my other stuff I got in that size did not fit and I think it just comes from different like vendors what am I doing it comes from different vendors and some stuff is should have size some stuff just isn't it and I should have looked more into it before I spent all this money so yeah um yeah definitely keep pile I'm surprised at the quality of um the things I did like the shorts were not bad quality at all for like 10 I think the shorts were like ten dollars nothing and the clothing haul was over twenty dollars and that's kind of weird to me i don't know i thought it would be more expensive but i'm just now thinking about it so i don't know oh my god i was so excited about this shirt i am going to end up reordering it because i was excited about this little shirt okay <laughs> i love the office um and I'm very sad that it had to be like this, but I mean, you know, if you are a Parks and Rex ass bitch or you just don't stay in the office, then I mean, I don't know what to tell you. I mean, that's kind of suspect, okay? But this shirt is in a, I want to say zero XL. One XL and it still didn't fit. First of all, it's made to be like a crop, which they do not tell you. Let me say that, they do not tell you. Is that grounds to sue? I don't know. Tell you, look how just like fucking short it is. I don't know. And um, it is a 1X, but it fits so tight. And like, I just looked disgusting. <laughs> I just look gross in this shirt. Quality feels like, do they say what kind of um, stuff they use, I wonder? I don't know. Spend 97% polyester, 3% spandex. Who the fuck is making like t-shirts and like spandex? I don't know. Maybe this is why. I don't know at this point. I'm just um flabbergasted. You know what I mean? I'm not keeping them. They fit like both the shorts, they fit um around my butt area but not around here i'm not this wide i didn't really like the rips i don't know they just like weren't speaking to me at all literally this was supposed to be a set i'm gonna show what it looks like just know i have hella like under boob and it just like wasn't a good look i don't know what else to say other than that <laughs> and these like paper bag shorts the quality feels like a fucking paper bag okay it just like did not do me any justice no ass moment put on their inside out um didn't give me any ass i can't even tell like what part is the front or the back i i genuinely don't know which i'm upset about um and you tie them like a bow and then you're supposed to do it kind of tight so then like this like ruffles up and it's a cute concept like the um 
picture once again made it look better the shorts are very long maybe i'm just short and like stubby i don't know but the shorts are long on me they don't give me any ass and i'm just very upset about it and obviously it's fun going back so um let's start off with these like accessories so i got this like handcuff bracelet i thought it was actually like a vibe like i thought it was really cute that this is only two dollars because you can't really like wear it to hell and back like you have to give it a break or else they'll like turn this is really cute i feel like um yeah whereas with these you can um i've had these since my birthday and they're still like going strong they don't turn i wear them almost every day sometimes i get lazy and like shower in them and don't take them off because i'm just like a fucking lazy ass bitch and um they're holding up because it's like real silver like they haven't turned or anything yet i got these from dalmata for for both of them they're like 80 dollars am i saying that right both of these chains together were 80 dollars and um i really like them this one's like you probably noticed already but this one's an angel and then this one is like a cross and um they're my favorite chains by far yet like invest in real jewelry because they last a lot longer than buying like these are like forever 21 necklaces like over and over and over again um it was pricey but i mean you know it's worth it and they're gonna last you a long time so uh may oh my god dalmata sponsor me maybe i don't know literally i heard about it because billy eilish buys her jewelry from there and a lot of other like mgk what's that guy's name mgk kelly <laughs> machine gun kelly um <laughs> buys um shit from there so yeah that's how i heard about it next up is this like dragon ring can you see that <laughs> i've always wanted like a wraparound ring but i could never find a good one this was two dollars this ring was like 152 dollars i'm shook um it doesn't fit on like my ring finger and i'm scared to like try it but you know it fits on my this finger you know what i mean so like whatever it's pretty cool i guess oh next up we have, I bought three purses. This is by far my favorite. It's a little crossbody bag. It's nice and like pink and dainty with these yellow like um, accents. I think like accent zippers or whatever. Um, yeah, it's super cute. I love the quality. Uh, the quality is actually really good. I was not expecting it to be this good. It's like quilted. Nice. I was so excited for this purse and it came. I'm like, what the actual fuck? they um botched the quality it looks so different online it looked like it was going to be the material of like this and it wasn't so that was disappointing as fuck because it's like a like stitch type of material so but the thing is you have to tie it yourself like it came separately with this bag and then this strap that you literally have to tie yourself and um i don't know imagine was walking through like the store and my bag like falls apart like kind of you know embarrassing as you know what i mean also it didn't come bucketed bucketed means like this is a bucket purse bucket bags look like this um it came flat and you have to pull these like hard ass like strings in order to get it to bucket and like this and the straps like don't stay down i feel like this is so like corny and cheesy i don't know um it wasn't what i was expecting at all i'm still deciding on if i want to return it or not um i threw away the packaging already so maybe i um, have to keep it by default still debating on if i hate it or not i had to refilm this haul again because i did like the way it came out and during the haul i mean during the filming the first time um i realized that this is a two-part bag so i'm gonna um i'm gonna show you separately first this goes inside of this and basically if you wanted to you could have like a clear like purse moment with these like flowers on it i don't know what this brand is but like i stand face piece these when it's saying like okay first of all go off you even like sound fancy i don't know i don't know this really just gave me hope like i don't know if i'll ever wear it because it has gold accents i'm not a gold 
kind of bitch. I like silver, obviously. Um, I just don't know. Let me show you what it looks like whenever this is in, though, because it's actually really cute. Like, I don't know. I, I kind of want it. I'm kind of looking for it. You know what I mean? Looks better. By um, Beast Winnesine. Beast Winnesine. Soon, Beast one assume you did your thing, bitch. I don't know who you are, but you did your thing when you designed this purse. Like, thank you. Also, I got these sunglasses, and on the website they were a vibe. I don't know. I'm I don't wear sunglasses that often. Well, I never wear them, but <laughs> again, they look different on the website. I don't remember them having like this little piece, and also the glasses were darker. I mean, I don't know, like. I feel like I would just not like them. You know what I mean? Like, how do these all look? I don't know. Like, these are kind of a look, maybe. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> these are a look. I decided it. Classy, sophisticated as you put them on, and you're like, um, contact my secretary. I can't talk right now. Okay, next I'm gonna show you um, some shoes I got, like literally just shoes. <laughs> First up, my literal pride and joy, these Doc Martens. I have not worn them yet because I don't think I even have anything to like pair these with, but I am just obsessed. I don't know, I might never wear them and just like have them on a shelf somewhere. And like worship them i don't know i just love these boots I, they just owning these boots make me feel like a bad bitch like they're just beautiful i don't know like i just really like these boots i don't know why i just got like some ones i'm kind of into shoes now they're such a simple shoe they're already creased i mean i kind of wear them a lot so you know what you expect i don't know something about them I feel like now that I have like money, I'm gonna be like a, a sneakerhead. I don't know, but um, <laughs> yeah, I'm in his shoes now. That's like a I'm going through a phase, I guess. I think that is it. All I have to show you from my haul that I wasted a lot of money on, and it's depressing. But I mean, we can just return it and like stop being a bitch about it. This online shopping is honestly either hit or miss, but this company like really fucked me over. They conned me, they bamboozled me. Say thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe, give it a like. Um, we have a lot of new subscribers. I gained like seven in a week, which is like, you know, kind of big for me, I don't know. But um, thank you guys so much for your support. Um, thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoy, what did I Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video. Just fucking cut the cameras. I can't do it, I'll show like bye.